This is tutorial number two, and it covers extruding within SOLIDWORKS. To start off, let's click File, click New, click Part, click OK. Now, to extrude a part in SOLIDWORKS, we first need to make a sketch. So let's click Sketch, click Rectangle, click the front plane, and from the origin, let's draw a square. Now, to make this square exact, let's use a smart dimensioning tool and let's make it 50 millimeters. And with the Add Relation button, click the length that we already made and click the perpendicular line. Click Equal, and now we've made a perfect square. Click OK. Now, to extrude the drawing, click Features, click Extrude Base, and you can see what our extrude will look like. Now, in this tutorial, I will be covering just a few of the actual extruding options. All the different extrudes are listed below. The ones I'm going to be covering is the Blind Extrude, Up to Surface Extrude, and the Midplane Extrude. The up to surface extrude is exactly the same as the up to vertex and up to body extrude. So I'm just going to show you one and you can do the rest for yourself. Okay, so the, for the first one, we're just going to do the blind extrude. So click blind. And for the blind extrude, it just comes out from the drawing as much as you want. So right now it's at 10 millimeters. And as you go up, it comes out more. And as you go back, it goes back more. So for this square, let's make it 200 millimeters. Click enter and now you see a preview of what it will look like. Now to accept it, press the check mark and you're done. Now let's go to the front plane and we'll draw another square right beside it. And we'll go across the dotted line so it's still on the origin. And click Smart Dimension, and let's make this square 100. And we'll use the Add Relations button again. Click one length and the perpendicular length, and click Equal. And now we've made a perfect square again. And click OK. Now click Features, click Extrude. And for this one, we are going to extrude up to surface. And all we have to do is we want to extrude it up to that surface is we click it. And now it's, it shows a preview of it, of that sketch being extruded up to that surface. Now click OK. And we have that. Now click the front plane again, click sketch click circle and across the origin again we'll draw a circle this time and we'll type in 30 as the radius click enter click OK and for this one we're going to extrude it through the midplane now a midplane extrude starts off at the green circle and it goes out equally on both sides. It's like the blind extrude, just that it goes halfway out one way and halfway out the other way. Now as you can see, as we increase it, both sides increase, and as we decrease it, both sides decrease. For this one, let's make it 400. Click Enter, click OK, and now we've extruded through the midplane. And that does it for the extruding tutorial.